guys, uh, so we didn't see your fight. So we're here interviewing people, but we heard all the counting out there. So, yeah. for so the honest at home, you, you, you beat someone up, so can you just explain what, what happened? happened in there? Make it down to um, us. To give you a short version, I went in there, coach said, feel him out. If you, can, if you feel like he's got something that you can take, take it. Yeah. I went out there, a few, few shots. He gave me the response I wanted, so we got the job done. Nice. nice That's nice. what she wrote. And we talked to you on the win, didn't we? We bagged into yeah, the yeah, streets. That's good, then. Yeah. 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 Oh, well and, and just for the honest at home, because we want the honest to get to know you. We're going to post that one. When we interview people, I just want to talk about fight. I want to talk about you, the person, right? I want our audience to know you, get invested in you as a person. So tell us a little bit about how you got into boxing, how you started, and how you arrived here tonight. All right, uh, so basically, I just used to be a gym guy. I used to just love enjoy. Uh, I just used to lift weights, train, bench. And then, um, basically, growing up, my dad used to be a boxer back in the day. Okay, do we know him? Uh, Patrick, he's just in the crowd somewhere, he's somewhere okay. around. Yeah. Okay. But um, he used to be a boxer back in the day, so when I'd go to my granddad's, we had a, well, most of the black guys know you have a front room and a living room. So <laughs> in the front room, that, the front yeah, room yeah. in the front room where the kids weren't allowed, yeah, yeah, my dad yeah, used to have yeah. trophies everywhere yeah, right. and just yeah. everywhere all over. And it kind of inspired me, I said, I want, I want that. I want yeah. to show my kids that if you work hard, then you can do it. 100%. That's where the dream came from, boxing, and then... Dave, uh, basically, just in and out of the gym, and then one day Dave took me to MTK to spar. Yeah. yeah. I, I had no amateur fights, no nothing. Sparred a seven-time national champion. Wow. Done all right. And then okay. we figured out that I have something, and we just built on it, and here we are. So, and we keep on building, and we keep That's on building. That's how we do it. Journey's Let, nowhere near done. Nah, it's all about every single fight, learning a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more, until okay, you arrive. Step okay. by step. And you'll know, you'll wake up one day and say, I belong. Yeah. And you get, them baby well, steps get you there, yeah? To be honest with you, I feel like I belong already. Like, um, I don't know what you've heard, but I spoiled some of the best guys. I believe I spoiled all the best guys around from my era in yeah. the amateurs, especially like Lewis them? Williams, so Lewis, 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 Lewis Williams is my uh, boy. Patrick Brown, yeah. like, all the top amateurs I've been in the ring yeah. with, and I never felt out of place. Obviously, yeah. they pushed me to the limit, but I never felt like I oh, shouldn't be here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I feel, I feel like the top of the sport is where I belong, and that's the end. Get there, stay there. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Lewis Williams is my boy. Yeah, I like, I like Lewis. Man. Great, yeah, he's a good great guy. Work. In great work. That was going to talk about his uh, ring name. <laughs> Listen, I got. Uh, uh, you stole that from my mate. You stole that. You stole that from my mate Richard Williams. <laughs> nah, the, the secret. <laughs> no, no, no. The uh, secret came from Coach Dave. You know yeah. Richard Williams, don't you? You know Richard Williams. Yeah, he's got a secret. Is that Coach, <laughs> Coach Dave over there? Coach Dave, Lamar. Yeah. Coach Dave. Did Come in. <laughs> so. So you know, you know, you know this nickname he's got, the secret. It ain't from Richard Stolen. Williams, is it? Sorry? Is it from Richard Williams? It's Richard Williams. Oh. Oh. It's, it was IBO world champion, oh. like middleweight. <laughs> My secret. <laughs> yeah, your yeah. secret. I gave him the name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the name. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he's got a secret. The secret. Well, the secret's out now. Yeah. Well, there you go. So the story's just beginning. There you go. That's right. Yeah. That's Tell right. the camera there. The trainer's on. Tell the camera there. Where are we at? This over here, Dave. Man, get that mic you must have to come over here, Dave. Tell the people out there how five is going in your life. Okay, um, this kid, Trader Secret, Newbury, Cruiserweight Division, look out. You've had a little taste of him, but there's bigger and better things to come. Um, some of the top boys have heard of him. I know he's going to be a problem. Let's go. Yeah, he's still, a, he's, still a work, he's still a work in progress. But we're getting there, we're getting there quick. So, um, boys, I hope you're doing your homework because this kid is. So when he comes to examine you, make sure you can pass your test. Okay? Over and out. <laughs> you hear that? Right. Very good. Hands, yeah, yeah, very good. Hands. Yeah. Respect, respect. Yeah, yeah. So, what, so what is your pathway? What do you want to do? What, what, what do you want to go through the bros? Tell us the steps. Is it the a traditional route? Yeah. Or is it or the you do it your way? I want to do it fairly traditional, but I do want to take a fast track. Like, fast I have no track. interest in building a padded 20, 20 fight record. Yeah. Right. On a, I obviously listen to my coach, listen yeah. to my management. Um, we're going to keep stepping up the test step by step. But the aim is to get the British, hopefully shoot for the, no, hope, get the English, shoot yeah. for the Eng British. British. And yeah. then we're going to test ourselves. If the that's chance good. comes up, we will be ready. Yeah. Uh, we believe we can go to the top and that's the journey. We didn't come in here to be second to anyone. Yeah. No, no, no. Good attitude to have. And when you fill out, you're going to go up to heavyweight and get that big money? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Some, of that, some of that Saudi money. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I won't yeah. be a cruiser for too long. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Uh, how old are you right now? Um, 28. 28. Yeah, been boxing. Oh, yeah. Only uh, been boxing seven years or so. That's seven years. Got in the game a bit late. Had my first fight at 21. Yeah. 21. 
Um, always took the fast track in the amateurs. Yeah, Short yeah. career, but we've yeah. done a lot. That's good. Done a lot. Yeah, yeah. You, some people are uh, not made for the amateurs, though, style-wise. Some people are better than the pros. I do, I do see I the think, amateurs style. I, I think I've always had a pro style. I've never had the traditional amateur, amateur style. style yeah, right. yeah. But it worked out for me in the amateurs. Like, I won yeah. the Nationals, I won the Harringays, I went on trial for GB. Yeah. yeah. I've, I've done a lot for the little uh, little amount of experience that I've had. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So I've proved it to myself at that stage. Could have stayed in it a bit longer and got a few more accolades, but the pros is where I belong. I want to put on shows for the people. And yes, I want to make a statement. It. Yeah. The and secret. The secret's yeah. out now. The That's secret's right. out. Listen, thanks for tuning to the 30 final round. Thank this you. won't be the last time we speak to him. Big things coming. The coach over there, he knows what he's talking about. Tune in, watch it. Don't, Don't forget, forget to like, share and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend. And we're here. And we out.